While conversational controls have simulations, G-code-based Okuma controls also have a simulation function to check programs. Begin by selecting the Auto Mode button. Press Display Change and cursor down to Animated Simulation. Press Input. The Machine Lock function is turned on so the machine components don't move while the program is being executed. On this two turret machine, both turrets are being displayed in this simulation. However, it is possible to run each turret's program separately. Press both the interlock and machine lock at the same time to activate it or deactivate machine lock. Press cycle start to execute the simulation. The feed rate override can be turned up or down during the simulation to control the speed of execution. To be sure, the animated simulation displayed for each tool represents the actual tool in the turret, it's important to enter the correct tool data and select the correct tool graphic. After a new tool has been installed, you will go to the Tool Data page to enter the geometry offset. With the cursor on the tool, press the Item Up or Down keys until the Tool Shape page appears. Use the Page keys to display the correct Tool Number page. Next, press Tool Item. Press Menu until the correct description of the tool appears. Once the correct image is selected, Perform the program simulation again to look for obvious programming errors. Once the description is correct, cursor to the form code box and enter the code of the graphic image which represents the new tool. Then cursor down to select the OK box and press input. Next, cursor to the tool angle, edge angle, and sticking out fields and enter the values as indicated on the graphic symbol. Press input when the correct tool data has...